Damn, I dropped my karma in that last video. It fell down on the ground, man. Ouch. Are you done, man? It's the grandson of Loner. Oh, if you come up here and your your uh, your charger doesn't charge up your computer, don't don't worry about it. At nighttime, everybody has their lights up on top of this mountain, and you got very little hertz coming up here, a lot and very little amps. And I couldn't charge my computer up here last night. That's the reason why I woke up so early in this morning. A little. A little hint for the day, if you come to Jamaica. Now I brought a heat gun up here. And for my vaporizer, I don't like smoking joints. I'd rather just fill up a big old huge bag full of THC and smoke it. Like in my other videos is the hippie terrorist. The heat gun I bought didn't have no heat adjustment on it. It only had two temperatures. And even the voltage up here wouldn't even run the heat gun. So, if you guys think you're going to bring a vaporizer up here, uh, I'd bring one of those little pin ones that I brought up. But I'm waiting to make some hashish before I use these pins. I'll just rip, smoke a joint. It kills me a lot faster with all the resins and shit you put in your lungs. See, vaporizer, you just smoking pure THC. I'd rather do that. But, uh, oh yeah. <laughs> One of the local guys up here, I'm not going to mention no names, but you'll see him in the video. If you come up here, you'll see him. But, uh, he's making me some ice. And, uh, and he has a couple bags of ice for me. So, uh, when I do get my pound of marijuana, yeah, you gonna be, we're gonna be whipping up some hashish. And we'll show it to you on, on YouTube. Hell yeah, we are. We're not afraid to show what anything we do in life on YouTube. Remember, this is day four. <laughs> And everything's just worked out so smoothly of what I was, ex more than what I expected in life. More than what I expected in a trip of Jamaican. So don't be afraid of what you go do in life. You just go do it. Go with the flow. It costs you a lot of money. You just go do it and just say, it hurt me. I'm broke, but... In reality, your memories, your thoughts, will be worth more than any gold you could purchase with that money. <laughs> My daughter was so pissed off at me. You're a selfish bastard. You just go out and spend your money on yourself. And you don't think about your children. You don't think about buying a house for us to live in after you die. You don't think about nothing in life. I looked at her and I said, You're going to be doing the same thing in life. So don't talk to me the way you're going to be living your life one day. Of course she's doing that already. My mom and dad set me down one day when I was very young. Said, son, when we die, you ain't going to have a penny in life coming from us. Now, you see all these other children running around this world when their parents die. They have a house and they have all the income that they stored in the banks. When we die, you ain't going to have a fucking penny from us. Because we all's going to enjoy our life with what money we have in life. And we expect the same thing to do in your life. You do the same thing. 
You go out and just live it. Don't worry about us. We'll be okay in life. You just go out and enjoy your life. <laughs> and I told my children that too. And I said, I think you're going to be telling your children this too. <laughs> I'm making my videos, guys. <laughs> How you doing? You want to smoke a joint? Have any more? Yeah. There's a rolling paper out there. Another thing before I go. You always offer everybody a joint to smoke. <laughs> <laughs> you make new friends like that very easily. <laughs> if you guys are non smokers, Good job. Don't get that giant, you know. Don't get that giant. Still come up here. They have the best food. As for your children, let them see the culture, let them experience life. Let them see what Jamaica is all about in this world. See y'all for my next video.